The Walmart relationship started with Children's Miracle Network Hospitals back in 1987 when um, Joe Lake and Mick Shannon traveled to Bentonville, Arkansas to pitch the idea of Children's Miracle Network to Sam Walton and they were able to secure a meeting and get in there and talk to them and talk to Mr. Walton and the leadership of Walmart and really sort of share with them the idea of this national program that would actually allow local hospitals to raise money with their individual stores and associates so that 100% of the money could stay local. And Mr. Walton's uh, comment back was that um, Walmart would amaze them. $36,618. Let's look at all that money that Sam brought to the Children's Hospital. $5,000. $566.21. $6,872.53. million. We've got $11,405.21. And you do this year after year, year after year, we're dedicated to children at Walmart. This is a, an event of passion for us. That's the bottom line, it's for the kids. There's something special about children. Anything that we can do for our children, I think, is very beneficial. Some of the most eventful moments that we've been able to have at our Walmart kickoffs have been when we've been able to have patients there to be able to share their story, but also for them to be participants in the actual kickoff event. So a few years ago when we had our first uh, Walmart kickoff at Regents Field, we had patient Bailey being able to throw out the first pitch. Or in the past, we've been able to have James there to catch a football when we had the kickoff in Alabama. And so we've really been able to try to tie our patient story when we've had Lindsey Jones sing the national anthem at multiple events. And we've been able to really strive to connect the Walmart associates with our patients. And I think a lot of times that actually happens outside even of our purview. Gracie Holland, when she was little, used to go to a local Walmart store and she used to walk the aisles. So the associates at that Walmart actually really got to watch her journey through all of her surgeries and through her childhood. It can be hard to ask every customer that comes through their register to make a donation. But what we strive to focus on with our partnership with them is the fun that comes out of it. And Walmart embraces fun. And they love to do all these wonderful events at their stores and at their warehouses. And they really get into this idea of, we want to make this fun for everybody. So they do some crazy kooky things and they love being able to, to have that flexibility to be able to use their own creative power to be able to create these fun, quote unquote, fundraisers. We have doctors that are able to ask for $5,000 in a research fund, and they're able to then get data points that then they can go on and get larger funds. And we have new programs within the hospital because of Walmart and Sam's Club philanthropy that we're able to have so that we have patients that are able to have access to very specific programs and services. And I think one of the main areas is that we are able to provide family-centered care to our patients so that we have a patient who's maybe here up on the burn unit and they're able to have a child life specialist come into the room and provide distractionary therapy so that that patient is able to take their mind off of being in a hospital or that we have patients that are able to come down to the room of magic and they're able to see movies or they're able to see characters from movies that are popular in TV shows and we have patients on the dialysis unit that are here for dialysis three days a week and they have access to a teacher who's able to come into their bedside and or to their bayside and to be able to provide schoolwork or we have chaplains that are able to go in to patients room and to provide that faith-based mission of being able to help them understand why they're here in the hospital. And the fact that I think always sticks with everybody is the Walmart associates on the individual level care so much about Children's Miracle Network and their local children's hospital that they strive to always amaze us and to always raise more dollars for their local children's hospital. And what we've seen right here in Alabama is that the leadership that we have is taking to heart what Mr. Walton said, is that the Walmart associates will amaze us and they have, time and time again. Thank you just doesn't seem enough, but it's the only word we have in the language to be able to show gratitude. And so for that, 
I would want to say thank you to Walmart Associates a million times over. Walmart is a major part of the Children's Miracle Network. We uh, thank them for that. A champion is someone who supports a cause, and none of CMN's corporate champions is more supportive of children's hospitals than Walmart.